We're playing nice. We're doing everything by the book. You know? Where is the source of the Nile? Gee, I don't know. Let's outfit an expedition for ten grand. Sounds good. There you go. So Prussia got nothing out of that war. England got a little bit of prestige. Ah, there you go. Italy just formed. And as always, Lucca did not join. I've never seen Lucca actually join. <laughs> so Italy has half of Switzerland. That's cool. And they also have Crete. Very nice. And they are also going to be a major power soon enough. So I'm not going to bother... I'm not going to bother trying to sphere them, because they should be a major power pretty soon. Yeah, there you go, number eight. Yeah, Russia's going to have 90 influence. Actually, let's make sure this happens properly. Let's lower everything else just temporarily. There we go. Just to make sure we actually get to 65. Yeah, there we go. There you go. Yep. Okay, so let's go over this again. Italy declared war on Lucca, just like last time I played. Lucca did not join when Italy did its unify Italy thing. Italy did not, I mean, Lucca did not join. So Italy immediately declares war because they have a core on Lucca. And Austria this time has decided uh, to kick Italy in the teeth. And it's going to work, trust me. Austria has 169 military, and Italy has 105. It's a big difference. So yeah, Italy, you're boned. Yeah, they just mobilized to 156, and Austria has 260 now. Wow. Sorry, Italy. You're gonna die. Well, you're not gonna die, you're just gonna lose Lucca. And uh, if it's anything like last time, Lucca is going to get the whole region, rather than just the one province. <laughs> it's silly how that works, because Italy, Italy succeeded in annexing them, and then Austria forced them to spit out Lucca again. But Lucca didn't just get one little province, it got the whole region <laughs> when they spat them out. Alright, so we got inorganic chemistry, that's going to give us nitroglycerin. Now we need iron steamers, and I'm wondering if we should do this now or after we start... Um, colonizing. I think we can squeeze it in, so let's try to let's try to get it in. That's what she said. And let's watch this debacle. Actually, let's not, because Russia is at. Wow, I'm glad I caught that. Russia is at 99.2 <laughs> or 99.8. Oh my God, <laughs> they are one day away from kicking us out of the Ottoman Empire. So, ban embassy. Russia. There you go. 99.8 down to zero. Cero. Nada. Not. You get nothing. Good day, sir. Oh, man, I'm glad I caught that. I got too caught up looking at this. Okay, so there you go. Italy annexed Lucca. But now... There it is. There is the bird. So maybe what happens... Maybe why it didn't happen with Colombia is because we didn't annex all of Colombia. We only annexed one province. So they didn't disappear from the map. So I guess since Lucca disappeared from the map, it automatically adds this uh, causes belly. So now Lucca is going to get the entire region of Emilia, which is, what, four provinces? Yeah, four provinces, rather than just one. Well, that's assuming Austria. They really should. There we go. We just got nitroglycerin. Fantastic. Now, Italy could draw France and me into the war, 
and Austria could draw the Ottomans, Krakow, and Sweden. So Italy does have better allies. I mean, I might even join that war, just to see how it goes, if they ask us to. Because that might be fun. I mean, so far it looks like Italy is doing a pretty good job of spreading the troops out and getting things done, but Austria really does have more units. I don't think Italy can hold out very long. Unless they call France into the war, then they have a chance. But uh, we'll see. I'm going to get my quarters out so I can do laundry in the morning. Austria. Oh, acquire East Switzerland. Ha! Huh. Yeah, yeah, that's... Wow. 16% already. Oh my god. Why aren't you calling France? Let's see. One, two. It cost me $2.25 to do laundry. There's a dollar... It's a dollar and twenty-five. Okay, perfect. There we go. Uh, free trade. How are we doing in Burma? Not bad. We're at forty-five. Not bad at all. And we're doing okay in Greece too. I would kind of prefer to get Burma though. Greece is not that important. Oh, there we got discredited. But see, they could westernize any day now. You know, they're already partially westernized. They could go full westernize any day. It would really suck if they did that. Yeah, Italy's armies are now dead. Well, it says they have 138, but they don't. Italy's armies are dead. All they have left is the troops that they mobilized from their farmers and... That's not going to be a whole lot of troops, and they're not very well trained. Ooh, a comet. Oh, let me click on it. Fuck. Oh my god, there we go. Comet was sighted in the sky. Some believe this portends... ...fell times ahead. Others believe that they are, in fact, pixie fairies floating in the sky. Uh, thank God we live in enlightened times, get some free research points, or keep looking at the sky, get some free research points. Uh, whatever. Free research points. Yay. <laughs> yeah. So, I don't know why they're not calling France into the war, but they're not. They're not calling us into the war either. It's a little odd, but uh, whatever. Still don't want an alliance, eh? Oh shit, I'm still influencing Colombia. Oops. Oh, never mind, we're banned. Huh. I'm all worried about it. Oh yeah, we can build a factory here, but I don't really want to. It's only one province. And we got kicked out of Greece. Not kicked out, but we lost all our influence. Okay. And what's a Union Liberal again? Let's go back to Party Morado, whatever. Still no interesting decisions, so we'll just do what we're doing. Yeah, 
Italy's getting trashed. Still nothing amazing. They're at negative 50. Ouch. Ouch. Was that really worth it? Was that really worth it? to Just to get one little territory? Now... Now Lucca is going to get all of Emilia, and they're going to lose East Switzerland as well. What a bad choice. Iron steamers. How long is that going to be? Ouch. 1969. I mean, 1869. No, we can't do it. We have to go for machine guns instead. Sorry, Charlie. Sweden has lost its great power status to Italy. Yeah, um... Italy's kind of losing a war right now. Sorry to say. Uh... Hmm... We could try to get Sweden into our sphere. That'd be nice. Not super necessary, though. Italy's trying to influence the Ottoman Empire. Oh, there you go. Yeah, see, look at that. Lucca got all of this. Instead of just one province, now they have the whole state. Why is Württemberg asking for an alliance? What the fuck, Württemberg? Württembergian Württemberg. <laughs> and Prussian Württemberg, of course. Hmm. No, I don't think so. I'd rather have someone else, like France. Or Austria. Or Russia. <laughs> Or anyone other than Württemberg. I mean, come on. Really. Ugh, UK and Austria. God damn it. Italy's demobilizing, and now they're down to a 12th. Yeah. And their country is split now. Look at this. Their country is split. They can't even access this anymore. I got discredited in Burma, so they really are giving us a chance in Burma. We're at 50, pretty much. We have to get to 100 to remove them from the sphere. But look how fast they're getting their influence back. They are crazy fast at that. Look at that. Uh, yeah. And we're discredited in Greece. Huh, even the United Kingdom is trying to increase our relations. Cool. They're sending us good tidings as well. Yeah, they're increasing way faster than we are. Oh, time to re reduce Russia. Uh, decrease opinion of Russia. Bingo. Russia's now cordial instead of friendly. Haha, take that, you little bastards. Who the fuck is this? Lubeck. No! Free people against Egypt. Okay. Now might be a good time to go to war with Egypt, actually. Just to get a couple of these provinces out of the way. Um, I really want to get Marsa Alam. But I also want to get City Barani. And Sicily failed to give this to Ethiopia, because Sicily sucks, apparently. They took they took Crete. They took Crete, but they did not do their primary goal, which was give this to Ethiopia. So we'll see what France does. Yeah, I, we really don't need the infamy right now. Curse of the Pharaohs. All pops in Spain gain militancy. <laughs> nice. That's cute. We're 
doing okay in Burma, actually. Even if they discredit us, we still should be in a good situation. The real problem I have now is Russia's probably going to get... Yeah, there they go. They're probably going to get the Ottomans out of our grasp. And there's not much we can do about it unless we abandon our um, goal of getting Burma. I'd rather not abandon it. How are we doing over here in Luzon? 94. Nice. Muzzle-loaded rifles. Breach-loaded. How long will that take? 69. All right. Poor Italy. That's got to suck. Tutankhamun's tomb. Get some prestige and 7,000 research points. Very nice. We found Tutankhamun's tomb. Uh, well, that's cool. Oh, we're at 65. And you know what? For the time being, temporarily, I am going to just give up on the Ottomans and Greece entirely. Let's see if we can't go nuts on uh, on Burma. Let's see if we can't make it happen. Wouldn't that be crazy? Oh, we got discredited. That's fine. We're, we're at 70. We're really close. All we have to do is hit 100. Mmm. Mmm, ice cream slush stuff. And yes, this has been sitting in front of me now for... for 3 hours and 11 minutes, according to... uh the recording software. It's actually kind of warm. Wow, so that's nice. That gave us, just for free, it gave us that tech. So that's really cool. So now we can go over to the Navy, get iron steamers. Can we get this? January 19, 1870. How perfect is that? Because that's the month, the very month, that we need to start researching uh, machine guns. Because it would get unlocked January 19, 1870. So, perfect. Now, can we do... Sorry, I think I hit the microphone there. Can we do... Uh, oh, that's right. We can't do factories anymore. Never mind. I was going to say can, we need to do... Uh, da, 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 da. Nope, we can only do clippers. We need the other kind of transports. But soon enough. Soon enough. 95%. France declared war on Egypt. What's it for? Ethiopia gets Asmara. Okay, so the same as Sicily. But let's see if France gets greedy and starts taking provinces. They probably will. A treatise on economics. Obviously, we must take pride in this publication, or certainly this is only propaganda. Okay, what happens? All middle strata get liberal. That's good. And we get prestige. Or poor strata... No, we'll take this. Get some prestige, and we get some liberals. Very nice. France wants access. Sure, why not? Egypt wants access. No, I don't think so. Well, they won't give us access. That's kind of, you know, dickish move there, France. Hey, you have to give us access, but we're not going to give any to you. Dick. Oh, let's get some access from England again. Yay! Free 30 points of bonus relations. My guess is France will get greedy and demand this region, City Barani. That's pretty common. Oh, 
Come on, 96%. We're almost there. Oh, wow. That's the biggest revolt ever. Look at that. Nine guys. Oh, no, no. 15 guys. Whoa, that is a big revolt. What are they? Cuban nationalists? Yeah, Cuban nationalists. Nice. Uh, that's more than I can actually deal with over there. Let's recruit some guys. Ooh, Spanish guard. We can do guards now. Yes, I love guards. Let's build some Spanish guards over here. Spanish guard. Spanish guard. Yes. Ooh, yes. Oh, these aren't guards. Oh, well. Just regular dudes. That's fine. How about down here? Yeah, one. Sure. Limit of 45. Very cool. How about over here? Nope. Uh, this could get tricky. Let's go ahead and fund our dudes. Just go all out. And we still have people not getting any fucking needs met. I mean, that's just ridiculous. Come on. Alright, you guys need to get extracted. So... Oh, we can't leave yet. Three days until we can leave. Oh, they didn't get wiped out. Thank goodness. They almost got wiped out. Not quite. Okay, well, best way to deal with this, pick up an army. And we'll just take 24 guys, that's fine. And go party. We'll start down here at the bottom. Wow, only one guy survived out of three. Eh, oh well. We keep getting discredited instead of kicked out. Yeah, uh, Ottomans are going to fall to Russia, which is totally unfortunate, but oh well. You know, I mean, it's not like we can do a whole lot about it at this point. I really want to get Burma before it becomes a civilized state. And it's almost there. They're partially westernized. They're well on their way. So is Persia. Who else is going to go soon? There's a lot of uncivilized crap going on. Algeria is going to go soon. That's pretty common. That's only a couple. I'm surprised. A lot of them just aren't getting westernized. They're just... I don't know. Oh, yeah, how are we doing in Luzon? The speed back up. 96 still. Alright. Doom, 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 doom. We'll get here any day now. There we are. I'm like halfway there. Oh, what are these guys? Philippine nationalists. Nice. Uh, yeah, okay. Go to the big one first. That's what she said. Guys, toast. Get on the boat. Come to this guy. Oh, there we go. Now we're talking big rebellion time. What do we got? What are they? Anarcho liberals. Nice. Okay. And we have some here in Morocco. 
and we have some down here. We'll just put you... Yeah, you're already on hunt. That's fine. We'll put you on hunt. That's fine. I guess that's it. Just a few. Yeah, nothing amazing. Still annoying, but nothing amazing. Alright, our boat's arrived. Let's go kick some ass. I should go kick these guys' ass first. And we arrived in Zamboanga. Where did we lose? Didn't lose there. What, we can walk across there? <gasps> oh, I didn't know we could walk across there. That is so awesome. Ooh, I like that a lot. But we did lose somewhere. Where did we lose? We didn't lose there. We lost over here? No way. Wait, what? Was I really not paying attention enough to the point where I didn't notice that we lost, like, the majority of our army? Did we really just lose the majority of our army? Uh... No way. We did! Oh no, there they are. <laughs> there they are! Wow. There we go. Don't ask me, guys. I just play the game, okay? But yeah, these revolts, they happen from time to time. Whatever. They're not the end of the world. You just have to keep your finger on it. Make sure you have some troops spread around so they can deal with it. And make sure you have navies that are able to move you from one place to the next. To kick them off your shit. Hey, you. On the boat. Go up there. These guys, I should probably split up a little bit. What do we have over here? We have Horsey and two guards. Let's go meet up there. Let's see. That's five units, and here we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we'll give you that, I guess. We'll group all those guys up. We have two little armies attacking everyone. Okay, the rebels survived. They're going to there. That's fine. Okay, you guys go on Hunt Rebels, so that should take care of m the majority of this bullshit. Hmm. There's still a lot of them to go, though. 81 in... Oh, man, we're almost there in Burma. 81 in Burma. Ooh, I can taste it. Okay, Philippines is saved. Hooray. <laughs> Not going to be a very big celebration for that, but whatever. Italy is still clinging to that secondary, I mean to that uh, great power status, just barely. France is 
probably going to get greedy. They haven't yet, but they probably will. Because they have no infamy, right? Oh, they have one. Yeah, they have pretty much no infamy, so they have a lot to play with. 